don't want it. You can have it. You know, I don't know, a bit of charity that is, guys. A bit of charity. Greater stone, I don't really need them. I don't use soul gems. There's some people in the world who are like mad over soul gems. Like, oh my god. Oh, I need to buy some stuff, actually. Uh, I need to buy some the hammers. But there are people who are like mad about soul gems. Like, oh my god, soul gems. And I'm like, yeah, boring. Buy 10 repair hammers. Repair hammers are what matters, baby. Repair hammers. That's the crack. Goodbye. That's the crack. That's the po that's the important stuff, guys. You don't you don't want any no you don't want no soul gems. I've never used them. I swear, I've never actually used them. I never I never ever ever use soul gems or make my own spells because I never use them. I mean, guys, if you think about it, guys, how many times in this LP so far have I used this? Apart from restoration. How many times have I used the spell? I mean, maybe once or twice, yeah, like, really dire situation, situations, like I did, I think I did, when I was against ghosts. But when have I actually used a, used a spell, when I could have used a blade, and the and I have used my Ancestor Guardian once or twice, but I don't use them much. I never use spells, at all. I never. I don't like them. And, like, people on games tend to be all like, oh, I'm always a mage, and I'm like, I hate mages. I don't know why. I'm like... I like fantasy, but I hate mages. I like warriors. I'm, I'm a warrior kind of guy. You never see me. I mean, in every LP I've been in so far, I swear to God, I've always been like literally. I mean, in Morrowind, I wanted us to be more stealth, more of an archer. I wanted to be different. I wanted to be more different for myself. I wanted to use the crossbows. <laughs> that was my main reason for choosing that. Um, in that LP, but in Oblivion, I'm a warrior. Um, what else am I doing? In Dragon Age, I'm a warrior. In Metal Gear, it's not actually a choice because you're, and I'm a secret agent in that. Uh, but um, you know, I haven't. I, I mean, in the Shivering Isles, I was a warrior. In the Dark Brotherhood, you, I wanted to play that properly, so I'm again more of an I'm an assassin kind of thing. Um, because that didn't really want to, I wanted to fit that into the, to you know, to help me finish the LP properly. So I didn't do choose a warrior. But uh, but you know, and then when I do my Skyrim LP. You get a choice. What the hell? <laughs> what the? Oh, it's a band that I probably stripped of their, clo of their clothes ages ago. <laughs> um. Yeah, but you know, I mean, when I do Skyrim, I'm, I mean, although you can choose it, I'm gonna be a warrior, guys. I mean, you probably already told that. When I do another LP, I'm gonna be warriors. When I first play games, I'll play as a warrior. Every time, I never ever choose anything when I play a game first time but a warrior. Is that bear in the ground? What is it with that bear? Okay, that's a bit weird. I'm just gonna kill it. Oh, I think I actually have those boots which do let, me, let the animals like me, isn't it? That's why. Oh well, I killed it. I killed it. It was attacking me, okay? It was attacking me. <coughs> Got a bit of a cough at the moment. I'm sorry about that, guys. Now there's also some news that the PS4 is going to be announced on the 20th of February. I, I hope they're wrong. I don't know, everyone's like, what? Again, I don't want them to release it yet. I'm, re I'm not finished with the PS3 yet. I want it to stay longer. Because I, I don't want them to... I want them to wait till I have a job. And I've got a job, which will be... I'll get a job as soon as I can. Hope, can they not just leave it until, I mean, I finish school? I mean, and I finish school in about a year and a half. I finish in, like, May 2014. Uh, and, I think, and I don't want them to bring it out in 2013 or 2014 because I'll be doing my exams. I've already had one exam already for science. And I don't know what I got yet, by the way. Um, but I mean, I've already had one exam, and I and I, I really don't want to have any more. But I mean, I don't want it to come out while all my exams are out because I just I draw. I mean, when that comes out, I mean, I won't be able to revise because I'll be too busy gaming, like mad. And also, I, I want to wait till I, I have a job, because as soon as I finish school, I'm going to get like a job for at least three days a week, so I can actually get money and buy my own things. Maybe get a better capture card as well, for that time. And it, and if the PS4s are out, I'll be getting the PS4, obviously. I mean, when I was younger, I mean, PS3s have been out for nearly two years, like, literally, like, two months, they were two months off two years since they'd been out. Um, so one year and ten months they'd been out, when I got my PS3. And I, I don't think I'll wait that long with a PS4 because back then I wouldn't have cared as much. But now I think I, I'd, I'd care a little bit more. But I don't think I, I don't want to get them straight away because I worry that they break very easily. 
That is my only concern on getting PS3 straight, PS4 sorry, straight away. Um, but hopefully, fingers crossed, they don't release any games I'm like, must get, must buy. Like, if Metal Gear comes out, I'll be like, no! Or Dragon Age 3, I'll be like, no! But if a game like if Dragon Age or something, or whatever, comes out maybe a year later, or a year and a half later, yeah, yeah, I'll buy one, I'll buy one. Um, but I'm really hoping they don't come out at the time, because I will be so pissed if they do. Unless they get it spot on and do a good job so they don't break. Unless they do that. If they do that, I'm fine. But I do. I, st I would still want more memory. I would want them. I would want the better versions with the more memory and you know, better network connect like connections and all that. Because they improved them all, all on that purposes and all that. I know everyone's like gaming PC is the best because you don't have to keep upgrading and all that. Apart from your graphics card, but you don't need to buy a whole new machine. You know, it's all that. I'm like, I don't really give a crap. I'm not a PC gamer, so uh, I'm not a console gamer. I don't see. I mean, I mean, I, I'm sorry if some of you are PC gamers and I'm playing on the PC. I know, but I think some PCs are arrogant bitches. Some PC gamers. I think they're arrogant bitches, and I want to kill them. Some of them. Some of them. Only some, because they're really arrogant. They think because they own a, P a game PC, they're like God. Like I own a gaming PC. Bow before me. I'm like no offense, pal, but I mean, okay, I paid you know 300 quid for my PS3. Okay, yeah, decent cost from when it was out. Yeah. You paid how much? Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> you paid. Um, how much did you pay? Okay, I paid about three thousand pounds for my PC. Yeah. So I. So yeah. So you have so much. Your PC is so much better than mine that you care to spend the extra two thousand seven hundred pounds. Hmm. I don't think so. No, that's my kind of opinion. I mean, they say better graphics, it runs smoother, blah blah blah. Yeah, but there's not. I don't think there's two thousand seven hundred pounds difference. Is there really that much difference? I mean, now it would be, too, you know, a bit less because PS3s cost less now. But I mean, I don't think there's that much difference. To be perfectly honest, I don't think there's that much difference at all to me, for me to do that. I mean, I don't mind some PC gamers. I'm not saying they're all bitches. I mean, just a few. Just a few. The ones who think that they're, that they're superior to everyone else because they have a game PC. I don't care. I'm a console gamer anyway. I mean, I don't think, even if I could afford a game PC. Um, I, and you know, you can make them cheap. I mean, I don't think I'd want to. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm more of a console gamer. I mean, I know you can all, I mean, you know, you can actually buy, uh, well, buy controllers and that for your PC, and that's one thing I would like. But all in all, I think I would prefer consoles, just for many different purposes. You can't play, I don't think you can play a, a PC on a TV, proper TV, can you? I, I suppose you can probably buy a, a, a screen for like, like a 50 odd inch screen and all that, but all in all, I think consoles for me are just a better fit. I, I like consoles, and that's what I'm going to stick with. I've been playing consoles since I was like three years old, and when did I play it? I've only... First time I played a PC game properly, my own PC game, was actually Morrowind. Morrowind... Well, I, I actually... I lie, actually. I did actually play a few demos on the PC back a few years back. No, not a few years, more like ten years back. The Simpsons, the game, and... Um, and uh, robots, the video game. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's about it. As you can tell, very kiddie stuff because I was a kid. Oh, that game was so good. Like Harry Potter. What the hell happened to Harry Potter? One, two, and three was just so damn good. Oh no. Um, you know they were just so damn good. One, two, and three were like god games. They were like oh my god. They were actually no joke. Those games were game of the year contenders in my opinion. They were just so good, but something happened along the way, and it, it just ruined everything. My PC is making a bit of a sound now, but for some reason. But I can't believe it. They ruined it. They completely ruined the Harry Potter games. Ask anyone who's played them. 1, 2, and 3 were amazing games, and I still think they're really good. I haven't actually got 2 and 3, but I've got the first one. It's amazing. I still play it. I love it. It's on the PS1, but it's still one of the most amazing games of all time. Okay, it's not my top 10, but it's like 12 or something, or 14. I don't know. It's in my top 20 by far. Which is good for me, because I've played like 100 games. All together, in my life. So, even if you count in that way, even even 30th place is good. They're very good. I mean, and if Harry Potter's like in the top 20, I mean, that's a bit weird. It's like the only decent movie license game of all time. 
I don't know what happened to the, the, those games. They were just they were so good and they just ruined it. When they started making it more movie like, they just they just destroyed it all. God, I wish I could take back time and just and just slap the developers in the face and tell them start messing everything up. God, if I if I could have done that, I would have because I could they could have made all the games so good. We only got three. Well, actually, they're all and and not counting Deathly Hallows Part One. They're all good games. And and the Goblet of Fire actually. So not counting those two, they're all good games. But f but the first three were amazing. And they could have made from that a eight amazing games if they actually just decided to pl to do what they were doing originally. And have you noticed, God? It's always EA. It's always EA, isn't it?